Welcome to section 32 of my jewelry design in ZBrush course. So section 32 is working on a few different elements such as design integration and thoughts as far as design is concerned. Um, hand sculpting for the skull we've got here and also how to apply and use curve on surface brushes effectively to create chains and the flame. Now this is the first one, this is the Ghost Rider ring and this is the first one in a little series that I'm doing on skulls. So be prepared for section 31 to feature some of the same assets to save us redoing them. We'll be looking at some uh, advanced features during this section of the course um, plus retopology and um, obviously decimating the model down so that it's um, of a achievable file size for uploading or for sending out to casters. So this is quite a big course, it looks uh, pretty effective the ring once it's finished. I've just done a render here for you guys to look at. So if this is something that you're interested in then make sure that you take my jewellery design course in ZBrush and I have at the moment over 360 videos, video lectures um, approximately I don't even know how many hours it's got to be over 80 90 hours worth of video content and uh, for the price that I'm doing it for um, it's an amazing amazing deal so grab this before I put the price up on this course because it's getting so huge uh, the price is going to be going up if you pay once then you've got access to all the latest videos on jewelry design in ZBrush plus access to my Facebook group where I will help you personally if you're stuck with a project and need some help in utilizing ZBrush into your jewelry workflow. Visit the link below to find out more about the course.